Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today they updated the Legacy stuff. They added a pack to the store where you can open it up for 50k coins and get yourself a Legacy card or collectible, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to pull the Bears, so not terrible. Uh, it's something I needed, so I'll take it. Uh, I, I need five more now, guys. Five more, and we get that million coins and that Sherman. And I just think the greatest thing in the world just happened. Yes! Kurt Warner sold, finally, for crap amount, but, you know, I still made profit. I still made, like, 50k more than I would have if I would just sold the Elite Badges, so you know what? I'll take it, and yes, thank God he sold. I've been, I've been waiting for that forever. Uh, but we got that Legacy Collectible also now in head-to-head -head seasons, in those head-to-head -head season packs where you used to, uh, let's see here, let me get to it. Is it? It's under Vol... No, it's under Warehouse. Alright, so... Now, if you go over here, there's now Key to Legacy. You're gonna get Key... Legacy Key Pick... Are these auction mode? No, okay, good. Uh, but the Legacy Key Pack... Uh, you'll get these in each of the Head-to-Head -head Seasons packs. Uh, if I read the information correctly... Uh, so you'll get the Seasons Pro, uh, those cards, and then... Or the... the I don't even know what I'm trying to say. These cards, these head-to-head -head seasons that I have two in my... I don't know why I didn't collect those a long time ago, but... I'm most likely going to be play, going for Mutt Master again. I'm pretty darn sure that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to, you know, suck it up here. Get that Redskins collectible. Get the Raiders. Get the Cowboys, the 49ers, and the Packers. So, it's going to be... That's that's at minimum 50k or not 50 50 of those seasons packs and what I'm doing just because it makes it easier to win the Super Bowl and stuff is I'm just demoting myself like or here's where I see my record all right look my record's crap it's 72 and 67 because you can see I have six demotions because I did them on purpose because. Once you get up, to, I'll be the first one to admit that I'm not the best player in Madden, so I'll be straight up honest <laughs> and tell you that most of the people in like all Madden second and all Madden first can beat me, just just to be honest. So I just keep going. I complete pro and pro first, and I get demoted back to pro second. And then I just do that's what I was doing. Then I stopped because legacy collectibles are so frustrating to pull. But you can see you get six. So if I won the Super Bowl, I get six packs. And so I give me 12. So I got to complete pro first and pro second. I got to complete them. What is that? Four. Four. And I got to complete two pack. I get two packs. I got to make the playoffs and avoid demotion. And I would get 50. So I got to beat them four times. I got to win the suit. I'd have to win the Super Bowl four times. And so that's eight Super Bowls, and then I'd have to get a play, avoid demotion, and then get a playoff berth, and I would get my like to get I get my master. That's not too bad, to be honest, compared to what some people went through. So I'm gonna have to finish this up. Probably my goal to finish because I'm I think I'm gonna finish up. It's probably a very poor decision now that I'm sitting here thinking about it, but I think I'm gonna finish up the ultimate gauntlet first. Just because it's not that hard. And I want to watch the NBA uh, three-point dunk contest tonight. So I might just grind those. And I'm also going for Vic. Uh, so it'd be nice if I could get Vic without having to spend any of my coins for Mutt Master. So let's take a look at that. How much is he going for now? Ultimate team. Two, no, 1.6. 1.69. Not bad. I can do that. We're at 1.438. I could get this tomorrow. I might even be able to get it today. 1.6. Your boy is so close. So close to Michael Vick. Wow, he's wow. He was 1.8 last night. Yep, I'm I'm, I'm gonna get this. I don't know how I'm gonna get it. I'm probably gonna open up one of these legendary bundles because, at worst, I could pull like 
George Blanda, get like 10k. <laughs> but, yeah. You know what, then this video we're gonna open up one pro pack. If you wonder what this had, I had like 16, I had like money left on my account, and I didn't look at this first, because I'm stupid. Because if I would have had 1600 and I would have only had to buy, like, 5750 and then like 500 and be able to buy it, now I gotta buy more. But we're gonna open up one pro pack, we're gonna yellow this pro pack. Because why not? And I'm just gonna quick reveal it, hit it with the quick reveal. Alright, Joel Petonio. Um, I'll sell all those silvers later, because now they're actually worth something. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't. I will most likely be back with a Legends Pack bundle. Probably buy it off of GameStop online, because I ain't going out, because the weather is freaking crazy here. So, yeah, we're going to get Vic. I'm getting Vic today, maybe. Debatable. If I pull something good out of that Legend Topper, it's feasible. I could just be... I could, if I really wanted him, I could just sell Ed Reed or Revis or someone and get him, but... You know, for now, we're just going to hang out. I'm just going to kind of chill out, wait on that. Also, the other cards that uh, I want... There's only three cards right now that I truly want to get. Like, if I got these three cards, I'd be happy. Like, I'd be done. I'd be able to save coins. But first is that Vic, you guys know. And then this Adrian Wilson, because if you didn't know, he played for the Patriots for a little bit. Uh, but kind of want to pick him up, because this card's actually pretty solid. I like it. His catch, I don't know, people were telling me his catching was awful. 72 is not terrible. It's not great, but it's not, like, horrendous, like some people are making me think it was. And then finally, the last card is the Deshaun Jackson. How much is he going? 400k is not bad. 404k for, D for D-Jax. I'll get him here. I'll get him here eventually. I'll probably get him before Adrian Wilson, most likely. Yeah, I'll get him before Adrian Wilson. But I think I, I, I'd ha I'd sell the San Antonio Holmes, obviously, get, even though I like this Holmes. But I don't really want to get rid of either of these. And my, my wide receivers are so short, it's ridiculous. I don't have a... I don't even have a six-foot wide receiver. Dante Moncrief doesn't count because I don't use him. Hester's not six-foot. Amendola's not six-foot. Oh, my gosh. My, my wide receivers are so short. It's ridiculous. I went from having Calvin and Dez and <laughs> and, possibly, and uh, Andre Johnson for a little while to, you know, hanging out with not anything. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. Let me know if you're going to be uh, getting uh, Mutt Master now that it's a little bit easier to get those stupid legacy collectibles. I wish they would have done this a whole lot, a whole amount of time later. But I'll do a video about Mean Joe Green and Dan Deerdorf later. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you later. Peace out.